Hey, Chris and Larry family, welcome to December. Now, every single day in December, my family is going to put together some sort of video on our YouTube, uh, a vlogmas, if you want to call it, but it's many, many of the different things are going to be gifts that you can create from home to give to family members or hostesses at parties and things like that. So today we are going to be making some infused sugars. Now, limes and lemons and oranges are key in this, but so are a lot of other flavors. Now, know that I will have a bunch of recipes on our blog at kristenlarry.com under December 1st for today, but all of the videos that we have will have a link to something on our blog over the next month. So check it out. We'll follow me along on this video and I'm going to go ahead and get started. All right. The first recipe that I'm going to make is a chili lime infused sugar. You're probably thinking, what the heck would you use this for? I don't know about you, but if you've ever tasted the first recipe that I'm going to do for you today is a chili lime infused sugar. Now you're probably thinking, what the heck are you doing, Chris? What would you use chili lime sugar for? Well, it gives a whole new element when you're making sugar cookies to roll the sugar cookie balls in a chili lime flavoring. And it's got that sweet and that spicy flavor. So we're going to start out by zesting a lime. Okay, so I have this huge lemon or lime zester, citrus zester that I picked up on Amazon and I'll have the link in the description below as well as on the blog, but this is awesome. It is a whole, you know, what, eight inches, six inches, I don't know how long that is, long. And we're gonna go ahead and zest that lime. All you do is rub your lime after you wash it, you rub it along and you take all of that zest and you're gonna add that into your bowl. Well, one lime made a ton of zest, but we only need just a little bit. We're only going to be using a tablespoon of that. So about half of what I've got there. We're going to add that into our bowl and then get mixing our spices. The next two ingredients that you're going to need is a quarter of a teaspoon of chili and a quarter of a teaspoon of cayenne pepper. Now you're just going to mix this in with the lime and very simple. It does not have to be expensive. I get these in our Mexican food um, aisle rather than getting expensive because we use a lot of the chili, but you can use whatever you have on hand. Okay, so I've got these ingredients in. So lime zest, chili powder, and some cayenne pepper. Now we're going to go ahead and add one full cup of sugar into this and mix well. Okay, so that's got some heat to it. I did taste this one. That new uh, chili powder that I uh, just picked up is a little bit spicier than what I normally use. Now I've mixed this all together and the key to giving a great gift to someone is presentation. A pretty jar. You can use a mason jar and do a decorative outside and put a bow on it and that. I pick up these jars. They come with these little plastic lids for the kitchen. Um, I use them for my bath salts as well. So this is something, an idea for you. But this will hold about well, two thirds of what you've just created. The rest of it put in a Ziploc bag and use for yourself. Now, because the lemon, or excuse me, the lime has moisture in it, you need to make sure that you let this dry out just a hair before you send it to a friend <laughs> so that it does get a chance to um, dry all that moisture out. Now with me, with my fireplace going all the time right now, it's automatically going to dry out, but you can put it in the oven on low. You can leave it out on, um, a cookie sheet overnight and it'll dry that sugar out. Or you could even put it in your dehydrator, but don't put it in for too long. You don't want that sugar to melt. All right. Besides adding this to a rolled cookies or something like that, you can also do the rim of your adult beverages with this. You can mix it in with some salt uh, for a tasty meat rub for your smoker. There's so many different things you can do with sugar rubs. Just know that they are all flavored in their own way and you can give it a try. So we're going to go ahead and make our second one now. Okay, the next one I'm going to do is just a mint infused sugar. And this is an awesome sugar 
to mix into your iced tea if you drink a lot of iced tea. But you can also do it, like I said, on the edge of cookies. And we'll have some cookies here throughout the month that we'll actually use them for and call for some of these recipes. Okay, so this is my own mint. It's fresh, so just know it will brown as it goes into this sugar. But what you can do is put it in now. I, I've chopped it into some very loose chops. And in about a week, I'll take it all out and put it through a coffee grinder and grind it up so that the sugar is a little bit finer and the mint leaves are that are left in there are um, grinded down. Now this is, like I said, great for cookies, great for adult beverages as well, but you can put this sugar into your iced tea. This is mint that we're growing on our, um, our aqua, or our, excuse me, our hydroponics uh, tower garden. So you can see how well it's doing. I've taken one cup of sugar, added it into the bowl. I used the leftover lime zest that I had from the last uh, recipe that we didn't use and then all those mint leaves. Now you can see those mint leaves are pretty big in here. But like I said, we'll go ahead and grind those up um, before I get this gift out. Now remember, it is all about presentation when it comes to your gifts. So you could take a ribbon and string around your jars and gift these for very, very inexpensive price. The very small uh, mason jars work nice for this too, the jelly jars. So there's a whole bunch of different recipes. I have a whole bunch of different recipes on my blog. So visit kristenlurie.com um, and the blog is right there on the front page and you can click on December 1st for 2022. Um, if not, you can click on the blog button at top and find it. But we've got vanilla sugar, coffee sugar, chili lime, orange vanilla bourbon, which is amazing on um, sugar cookies, uh, a lavender or a rosebud or a sriracha. There's all those recipes on there to give you an idea of what you need in order to create these amazing dishes. That is my Vlogmas 2022 December 1st video. Be sure and come back every single day for a new video on different gifts that you can make at home. God bless and have an amazing day. Bye-bye for now.